since we took the day out to the fair, I decided to stop and ask a few 4-H'ers exactly what were their thoughts on the fair, their projects, and what they enjoy about the Queen Anne's County Fair. Two local 4-H'ers, Hunter and Megan Mansfield, and they're going to tell us a little bit about their pig project and what happens on their farm. Hey, Megan. Hi, Mandy. It's so great to be interviewed today at the Queen Anne's County Fair. Awesome. So tell us a little bit about your pigs, what their names are, and where your farm's located. Well, our farm is located out of Centerville, um, Needwood Farm. Um, my pig is named Donald Trump, and we were going to do a political theme for the fair this year. Awesome. And you've already showed in one of your fairs, your shows? Yes, and I showed him and I got Grand Champion Junior. Perfect. So I'm here with Hunter Mansfield and he's going to tell us a little bit about his pig project. Well, my pig's names are Carly, Hillary, Ivana, and Ivanka, keeping with our political theme this year. Got it. And you've already showed your pigs as well? Uh, yes, I've shown two of my pigs. Nice. And how did you place? I got reserve champion with one and sixth place with the other. Great, wonderful. And can you give me guys an idea of why you joined 4-H and what made you pick the pig project? Well, I joined 4-H because you can meet a lot of new people and learn different things. You can learn about your hands, heart, health, and different things like that. And you always meet new friends and new people. What about you, Hunter? I joined 4-H because she was going to join it. I just thought, okay, I'll try it and see how I like it, but I actually really love it now. And like she said, you get to meet new people, and it's really fun to just be out here during the week in your camper, and you get to relax. It's very nice. Awesome. So these are two 4-H'ers that have put a lot of time and effort into their pigs for their pig shows this week. So stop out and see the pig show. So I've stopped in the beef barn, and I'm here with a special friend of mine, Adam Leager, and he's going to tell me about his beef project. Well, hey, Adam, what's up? Well, my cow weighs, uh, we, we work at a farm called Lieber, Leaguer Brothers Farm, and this cow is um, my cow, Roadrunner. He, um, he weighs 12, 16. He was born, I forget when he was born, but I know it was, oh, it was 2015. Um, we give him 13% um, protein. In his feed. In his feed. Um, and that's all I can talk about with here. Got it, got it. Now, um, have, did you show him already? Yeah, and I got first place for one of my cows. Fantastic. Cow. Awesome, awesome. And now, have you, how long have you been 4-H? Um, I've been showing my cow for two years. I've been showing my pigs for, I think, five or six. Awesome. And do you like 4-H? Yep, I love it. Awesome. Thanks, Adam. I also have another special guest that I found in the beef barn, Trey Ligger. And he's going to tell us about his beef project. Hey, Trey. Hey. So, tell me a little bit about your beef project. Um, his name is Spot because he has a white nose. Um, he weighs 1344, or 1344, 1344 pounds. Um, have you already showed him in your 4-H show? Yeah, yesterday. Awesome, and what did you get? I got reserve champion. Very nice. And how long have you been in 4-H? Um, probably ever since I was five years old. Very nice, very nice. And what is your favorite part about the fair? Showing my steer. And you have pigs also? Yeah. Awesome, thanks Trey. Mm -hmm. 